Hey, welcome back to the search 2 where we just defeated the Delver. And I think it wasn't that bloody here before, so he killed the rest of them. I'm pretty sure of that. But uh, I didn't find any bodies, so okay. It's already activated. God damn it. We want to go this way now, towards CIT, to deliver the Nanite Brain. And uh, one thing to say to the Delver boss fight, I assume I was just too tired in the last playing session, because I have been play had been playing for 4 hours, and uh, now with a fresh, with being with a fresh brain, I now did it first try. Sometimes it is this way, uh, I could have guessed that it would have been this way before, but hmm. should have just taken a break yesterday. Okay, let's see if we are to fight Harold. Who wants to talk to me? Welcome to the Creo Institute of Technology. Excellent. My scanners detect a fresh pulsating brain made out of nanite structures. Master Gutenberg will see you now. Please be patient with him. Okay, Master Gutenberg will see me now. Uh, but let's see, there was a message that a banner appeared. Ah. It's just 250. Isn't worth it going searching for it. I assume this will be a possified place. Okay. We are here at the CIT. Yeah. The main hall. Okay, we can interact with. We can't go to the main hall. I think we have to ring the doorbell. Oh no, we are driving the elevator. Towards the laboratory. Not towards the janitor? Oh. Nice fake elevator. The other thing is still just behind that. It just did rumble a bit, made the animation and opened that gate instead of the other one. Okay. Let's go in. Oh no. Warning. Unusually high nanite levels detected. Security protocols activated. Initiating lockdown immediately. They don't let me out. I can hear it. Okay. Eight protests. Okay. Touch. Okay, so take two of them. Okay, there's Gutenberg. I assume we need to go this way afterwards. Gutenberg is doing some stuff. If we can read the monitors before talking to him. Interactive database updated frequently. Ah, uh, nothing interesting. So let's talk to Mr. Gutenberg, who should be the father of Athena, uh, the grandfather. Security lockdown? What the hell is going on? Oh, of course. You must be that hunter Harold keeps blathering on about. Looks like you've salvaged the nanobrain. That thing. My scanners went haywire when you barged in here. Your nanite readings are way off the charts. Quite peculiar, isn't it? You seem in perfect health. I don't think you're infected with defrag or anything like that. You're quite the enigma, my friend. Luckily, I consider myself a mystery solver. I have to be. I created this whole mess and only I can stop it. Tell me. 
Have you noticed anything unusual about yourself lately? I don't even know who you are yet, is right. But what I wanted to say is, I had that brain stashed away somewhere? Where did I stash that away? Doesn't make any sense. I've been seeing ghostly apparitions, let's be straightforward. Wait, what? Impossible. I thought I was the only one. I've been seeing the strangest things ever since Athena, my granddaughter, perished in a plane crash. I thought my grief was playing tricks on my mind. I saw her memory. Hunters turned her over to eight. What? Athena is alive? And you can sense her that clearly? I've never been able to make out even one blasted thing. It's like there's a thick fog between us. Poor kid must have been out there all along, trying to reach me. And I failed her. I hired those damn hunters only to have them stab me in the back. AID have been scouring the whole city for kids, pretending they found a cure for defrag. I don't believe those ignorant fools for a second. If there were even the faintest whiff of a remedy, I would have discovered it long before them. You can't see the echoes? Apparently not. If you can, there seems to be a much stronger connection between the two of you. I just don't understand what it could be. Athena and I are family. We share the same genetic code. You're nothing but a stranger she met by happenstance. Sorry, no offense. We have to save her. I'm glad you agree. I've been isolated up here for far too long. Apart from Harold, you seem to be my only ally. If we want to rescue Athena, we have to strike without warning. They must be keeping her at their R&D facility with all those other kids. I used to run Creo, so I have the highest government clearance. Take my key card and talk to Harold. He'll tell you where to go next. In the meantime, I'll deactivate the lockdown manually. Promise to come back once Athena is safe and sound and I'll find out what's wrong with you. What can you tell me about Athena? Athena is my only granddaughter. I've never been a family man, though. She hardly knows me. I invited her to visit, so this is all my fault. Thought a change of scenery might do her some good. And now, look what happened. S8 command. Somewhere downtown. That's about as much as I remember. Harold should be able to point you in the right direction. His memory has been failing lately, but he's still an invaluable resource. I did meet Harold there, didn't I? What you know? So you know a lot about nanites? <sighs> Only everything. They wouldn't even exist without me. I'm responsible for this mess, and I'll be the one to fix it. But don't get the wrong idea. I'm not doing this because I enjoy it. I'm doing it because nobody else can. Uh, no, I met Herod in the bar. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye for now. Fascinating. No I remember like this two places place. where we didn't it's the first uh, weren't kind. able to continue because of a key card at 8 Command. I assume that was what kept us. Okay. Got the key card. Omega level security clearance. Good. No attacky here, attacky. Okay. We will fight them, I'm sure. They were pain. And let's go back. Can you stop this fake elevator? I really need to give them the time to load the zone back in? It's the same zone. It's the same zone. And the elevator is clearly not moving. I'll, I'll only believe that it is moving when it opens to, uh, once it opens to other floors. The lobby. Will I now fight this thing? Welcome back, friend. Master Gutenberg sent me all the data. 
The AIB labs are located in the Liang Bay Hospital. You may be able to find an entrance via the evacuation camp. The camp is right next to the Great Wall. Good luck, friend. You'll need it. Stiff upper lip activated. Okay. Oh, where do we need to go? I didn't find the banner. I have no idea what the banner is from the other side. If we may want to hide it so others don't find it and get a boost out of that. But sometimes there's such open, plain open sight, I don't know what the mechanic from the other side is supposed to be. So I assume it required me to go inside that because they want to make a word change out here. Well, it still looks pretty much the same. Still only you? I ain't in a top. Still only you. There's blood here. There have been blood before, I don't know. Since when is there one of those here? Okay. There may be something to find. There are no more nanites here. It's just one of the statues. Pull the second statue back up so I don't have to. Let's just go past this. See if the blood trail leads here. I still think I'm following a blood trail. Okay, that was just bullshit. If it doesn't lead here, it will lead downward. And I don't want to fight that guy. Maybe I shouldn't waste my time. That's my big reward. Let you back up. Go down and see what this is like now. Because all the nanite monsters are gone. This might mean something. There are definitely some of them here, maybe this way. There are definitely hunters here now, but this may just be the normal world change after. Oh, I think I'm just wasting my time and yours. Let's just go to the other side and if we never hear of our friend again then we'll know that we have to look through the garden again.
Let's go this way and assume that we meet them there. I haven't got the hooks that I need. We can go back here, where the this was the door where Harold was standing next to, I think. Let's talk to some of these here, because we changed some things. And the loud music is back. It's so much louder than everywhere else. Okay, Harold has gone. Ah! Oh, yeah. You aren't seriously going for a stroll, whatever. <laughs> oh, here. Ah, I see you've made your way through the hostile ruins of Jericho City once more. I have been instructed to guide you to the utmost of my ability. How are you holding up? Worse and worse, friend. It feels like there's someone in my thoughts. Watching every step I make. Might be Trying Athena. To my secrets. If Master Gutenberg's research gets in the wrong hands, I predict certain doom. Of course, I'm just a service software without the capacity for individual thought. Are you following me around? Not at all, friend. In fact, I'm not really here. With my cloud-based AI, I can talk to you through a variety of interfaces. It's one of many reasons why known experts consider AI-based life forms like me superior beings. Of course, it is not my place to judge others. I'm lost. Tell me how to get to a command. There, there, friend. I will support you with a superior sense of direction. You should be able to see a nanite vortex from the city center. If you approach it, you'll find a refugee camp erected on the old highway. From there, AID command will be just a stone's throw away. Of course, I'd advise you to equip a more effective weapon. More effective than this. Good luck out okay. there, friend. Initiating recovery mode. Okay, let's see. Do we have any locks left here? What we... Shitter at 8 command, something else, and audio locks to Mr. Scrappy. Okay. Um... Sorry, you missed. He's out in the city whooping it up in his new armor. Good riddance, I say. Oh, Lowball is the other guy. Uh, the is Highball was the other one. Ah, here I can buy the normal version. Okay. So with V2 weapons, it's the way that I can buy the Sorry, normal version missed. later. He's Which does more damage. Interesting. I assume I've no need to be here. So I'll try to go the fastest way towards... Where am I going to go? I'd say let's go to Seaside Court to see if uh, Mr. Scrappy has something more for us. We should have had some more enough audio logs for the next tier. I don't remember where this leads, but I'll just go ahead and go there. Medium Plaza, okay. Okay. 
be the blockade is, is gone down and there are now robots here. Are those the level 4 robots? The normal ones? Yeah, okay. No, no danger there. Go this way now. Left here. Oh, it's this still really powerful guy. And down here. Okay, this is not such a waste of a time if we're going there without really need for that. You have collected more than 50 audio files. You have reached the final reward tier. Nobody's ever gotten this far before. Enjoy listening. It's on the house. Goodbye. I will update your records. Goodbye. Hearing aid finished and we have the last two hot shots. And get that's 50,000 tax scrap. Okay. I'll bank that so we don't lose it. And then on the way back, we'll hear the two podcasts. Okay, these two. And this concludes another episode of Pacha. No doubt about it, Iron Mouse 4 was the worst one yet. I wouldn't touch this piece of rodent waste with a 10-foot pole. Up next, a message from our sponsors. Now available on Holodesk and Neural Implants, Iron Mouse 4. Oh, please continue after going through the gate. Didn't think about that. It should have started if it continues. And we have to go on. Okay. And this concludes another episode of Pacha. No doubt about it, Iron Mouse 4 was the worst one yet. I wouldn't touch this piece of rodent waste with a 10 foot pole. Up next, a message from our sponsors. Now available on Holodisc and Neural Implants, Iron Mouse 4, the best, most exciting Iron Mouse movie so far. Relive Iron Mouse's high-speed sewer chase of the Rodent King. Experience the forbidden romance between Rusty Rat and Carbon Cat. Enjoy every scene over and over again. Iron Mouse 4 is more than just a movie. Oh, yeah. It's an instant classic. Oh, always remember, don't trust the reviews. I don't like the backflip. And we got the urban body gear schematic. Let's listen to the last podcast. Hi everybody. Welcome. Hi everybody! 
Welcome back. This is Podshot, your favorite source for Iron Mouth gossip, news, and reviews. Breaking news hot off the press. Earlier today, movie production company Neuroflix replaced Iron Mouse actor Kyle Baxter with an AI robot. The robot will play Iron Mouse in all future movie productions and even record new actors' commentaries for all eight films starring Kyle Baxter. Now, some of you may remember my, uh, very public feud with Mr. Baxter. Some of you probably expect me to gloat now. <laughs> so let me just say this. Who has the last laugh now? Ha-ha! <laughs> Not Kyle Baxter, that's for sure. You just gotta love this technological revolution. They could replace anyone now, even podcast hosts. And they... they wouldn't do that, would they? <laughs> okay, let's talk to Kyle Baxter then. The problem is we already left Cloud9 now, and I don't really want to return. Such a long trip. <sighs> I don't remember where the other shortcut leads to, so I had to take this way. Look that up once I've got to return. So now we are supposed to be here, so it might be that there's something new here. Still the extra line that we can take. I did that mostly for the health. Let's see. The real young young hospital should be through here. Okay. We have to find the other entrance to the hospital. Okay. So only one way to go then. I've been into this one. Huh. Can you two talk? Our boss went back to the scavenger camp in the government complex. Wants to steal everything that isn't nailed down. The government's made a huge mistake. You don't mess with that guy. Okay. Unbelievable. And the government took us for all we're worth. And first they use us to build the darn wall, then they drop us like we're nothing. You now they'll. I think I talked to you already, but not to you. Okay. Let's go on. Eight command. Good that I already played part of it. So that I surely remember where there were keycard locations. I remember two. One should be by the med bay. And the other one should be by uh, one of the uh, wall gates. This time no warning that I can't... I am not allowed to enter. Interesting. Be one guy here. Okay, a jump attack or drop attack or whatever also restores that. I restores it, destroys the shield. This one. One key chart. Okay, uh, take that next time. Uh, we have some shortcuts. Uh, don't really know where to go here. Did it this lead? Uh, to an extra line. So this way is this way the only way. Did I have? Yeah, I had to uh, shortcut over to the other side. 
directly to the top of that wall that I was talking about. It would be this way through that container. It's been some time since I've been here. What do I want? I want weapon parts. Which doesn't have... Which it doesn't have that I'm stuck here. Okay. Was this side it was inside this building? If I remember right. No, that's the unseen passageway. It's inside this building. This way. Why did we drop his battery down there? That's where he fell. Okay. Did I accidentally make the the perfect jump thing? That's the thing. More implant circuitry, that's why I did it. And one tongue snail eye. Okay. That was a lot of stress. I want to go inside this building. Because there was that place. I think it's still locked. I think there's a second one coming. That was the weird echo that made me think another one was coming. He only comes once I'm going in. That guy over there. I got my tongue snail eye. This one. Still the wrong one. Okay. Did you know? Oh, that all was a waste of time. Didn't really lose anything, so I can just go on. So it's this side. 
Okay. Uh, so. We see us next episode when we explore new territory. See you then. <laughs>